so this is Anisha from India. Yes, hi everybody, how are you? Is it your first time on a Brazilian YouTube channel? Yes, I have never been on a Brazilian YouTube yes. channel. As a matter of fact, I have a very, very close dear friend, my childhood friend who's from Brazil, and I actually hopefully is watching this. Hey, Marta, what's ah, up? Say hi to Marta. Marta! Okay, então falando <laughs> português aqui rapidinho, é só pra dizer que esse vídeo tem legendas disponíveis, tá? Basta você ativar aqui no YouTube. Então tem legenda em português e em inglês, tá bom? Dá uma olhada no comentário fixado aqui se você não sabe ativar as legendas aí em inglês, right? And today we're gonna talk about the Indian accent because she's from India, right? And the first thing I would like to ask you is how did you learn English? Do all Indian people speak English as a first language? How does it work in your country? So I am actually originally, I'm born and brought up actually in Germany. I said actually a lot. I'm born in Germany. So I learned, I learned English in school in Germany. Um, but many people in India actually learn English in school. English is basically like the second mother tongue next to their native language, which could be Hindi, Tamil. Um, so we learn it in school. Does everybody speak? English in your country? Most of the time. I mean, of course, um, majority does because it is very necessary. If you don't know English, you can't get along, uh, around, sorry. Um, but there are parts of India like um, smaller cities, villages and places where there isn't enough education yet for people to learn English and the facilities are not there. Um, but other than that, um, people want to learn and there's an effort because we are still trying to spread education everywhere because we don't have enough schools or teachers in India yet to do that. Um, but we have many English speaking um, Indians, yes. You said people in India learn English at school, right? Yes. But what kind of classes do you have? Because in Brazil it's very focused on grammar and everything and we don't even learn how to speak the language at school so how is it in india i mean of course we learn the grammar um so from all the friends who went to school in india they all learn grammar from a very young age um you start also because in families you speak a lot of english again uh, there are families who do who speak more their local language um but you grow up with your family, with learning and speaking English with each other. But in school, most of the time, especially if you go to English convent schools where they only speak English, like there are literally people in India who just go to English convent schools um, and they learn everything in English. And the Hindi becomes like a subject, but otherwise everything is in English. Um, and some people also speak English with each other because as I said it's important but some people actually speak more their native language so then they're not comfortable in speaking so much in English um, but with time that is getting better the more of they watch so many English content from the US they all yes. watch like Big Bang Theory, How I Met Your Mother, Friends, Game of Thrones, mm -hmm. uh, Breaking Bad, it's all in English so they all want to know more and more um, English. So it's common to talk in English, to speak English with people who speak the same mother tongue that you speak, yes, right? Yes. So it's so different in Brazil because it's very like artificial. Don't? It's very artificial. Why would I speak English with my sister, for example? If really? we both speak Portuguese, it's very strange for us, you know? English is not part of our lives as much as it is in India, I think. It is like if you see the signs, if you watch movies, okay, it is part of our lives, but mm -hmm. we don't have so many opportunities. So I have something speak. funny to say to okay. this um, because in India, it is like the second mother tongue. But I'm from Germany, so I grew up actually with German. Yeah, she has so a crazy story. <laughs> I have a very weird story, guys. Uh, trust me, it's, it's strange. Get, go to my channel and then you'll understand what happened to me. Uh, the link is somewhere. Anyway, so what I was saying is, if you have that in Brazil, that people only speak in Portuguese with each other, we have similarly the same thing in Germany. Mm -hmm, so when I yeah. grew up in Germany, I did not speak in English to anybody. As you said, you, it's weird for you to speak to your sister in English. Yeah. It was weird for my sister, for me to speak to her in English because we only either speak German or Hindi. We don't speak English. I mean, I learned English in school, but still you don't really speak because you don't have to. You, it's not like you, you have English friends. It's not like you do, you need it to talk to a shopkeeper. You speak in your native language. You speak in German. Like, kann ich etwas haben bitte? That's German, by the way, guys. Yeah, uh, I was like, what did she say? I know. Okay. Um, but that's so, so that I totally understand because in Germany we go through the same thing. Mm -hmm. Anisha, many people, not only in Brazil, but in other countries, they mentioned that the Indian accent sometimes is a little hard to understand. Do you agree with that? Um, so I know there is a 
some people have a very strong Indian accent um, but you know it's not even their fault and it's, it's, it's hard because I understand if you don't understand or if you don't understand the type of accent it becomes difficult like I felt the same way with American accent mm -hmm. uh, I watched many movies I had no idea what they're saying because they were like oh well, you always say oh, well, so, oh you call rah, rah, rah. every country has their own type of accent um I understand like I can understand you I can and you have a special accent we Indians have a special accent if Germans speak English they have a special accent everybody has an accent it's a normal thing in the world so I wouldn't say something is difficult to understand or not it's just an accent and this is a matter of getting used to it exactly our native language has an effect an effect sorry on our English because that is what we've learned and spoken our entire life so even in India if somebody has a strong accent it's because that's how we speak you know um, and it's not even like our fault it's not even a bad thing right it's because they of get along not. in India of course but not. I don't agree it is of course difficult but I would say there's also other English which is like if Germans speak English that's also tough mm -hmm. if somebody's not used to it I feel there shouldn't be a stigma you know of on the sense not. like oh you're from Brazil you have an accent oh you're from India you have an accent oh you're from Germany you have an accent no because in our countries this is who we are this is how our, we speak right? this is our identity yeah. that's what I've been trying to tell you and guys you shouldn't care whoever wherever you're from is it Brazil is it India is it I don't know Taipei whoever whatever it doesn't matter your accent makes who you are accept that and we are communicating I think this is the most important thing we can understand each yeah. other very well yeah and we we're talking to so many people from so many different places mm -hmm. and we were still communicating and having fun and yeah. sharing our stories so I think this is the most the nicest part of speaking English because it, it connects so many cultures and that's fine yeah so tell us about the amazing work you do on oh. your channel tell them why I'm in love with your channel oh gosh she's so cute I'm, I'm, <laughs> so, I'm so feeling so shy right now oh, come on she's so sweet so so uh, I have a YouTube channel called Rikshawali. So Rikshawali is basically, I don't do you have rickshaws in Brazil? No, you have to explain. Okay, so rickshaws are basically tuk-tuks. There are these three wheelers. Uh, it's like a taxi. I'll but put a picture here. Yeah, okay. put a, yeah, there will be a picture. This is a rickshaw um, and we, we use it as a taxi to get around. It's very, very popular in India. Everybody rides in a rickshaw. You can't live without a rickshaw and I make videos in a rickshaw. I make comedy videos. Um, I try to make people laugh in a stupid, silly way. My jokes are not always the best, but I'm trying to spread happiness and make people laugh. That's what my mission is. And I talk about a lot of girls. I want to empower and help them and inspire them and tell them how amazing girls are. So anyways, I also go around the world and make foreigners eat and do Indian things, which is very entertaining, by the way, so you yeah, should check it, it out. Um, but yeah, that's kind of what I do on my channel, mm -hmm. so check it out. That's why I'm a big fan of Anisha's and work. I'm a big fan of her because she's empowering people. She's teaching people English. I mean... How awesome is that? We need oh, somebody. I wish she knew Hindi so she could come to <laughs> India and teach people in India English. So I really hope you guys like this video. I hope you uh, practice your listening ability with this video. And so I just want to tell you that it's very important for you to listen to different accents because English doesn't belong to Americans or to British people anymore. English is spoken everywhere in the world, so you have to get used to all these accents if you yes. want to communicate with Exactly. Everybody. I hope you understood me. <laughs> uh, they have, they have. <laughs> and please follow Anisha because she, you speak English in most of your videos, yes. right? Most of them, yes. But make sure to like this video, mm -hmm. make sure to share it and subscribe and comment and show everybody in your friend circle this video so that they can see that people from different countries with different accents are working together, talking together. Love punch! Love! So we do, do we do it together. So love. 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 Punch. Exactly. Okay, so thank I you. Hope you guys liked it. Bye. Bye.